Daily Fire episode 329 is I have a standard of things that I do and my feelings have nothing to do with it. Now listen to me for a second. What are a couple, what, what, are the, what is the, the standard that I'm trying to hold? There's a standard that Monday through Friday, I train at 4 a.m. And I used to get up at 3.20, but now I'm getting up at 3.10. And you might say 3.10 and 3.20, like it's not that big of a difference. But I've 3.20 for a really long time, and I'm trying to go up another notch, so I need that extra 10 minutes to get my shit together. And so that's the standard. So when I say that's the standard, it doesn't matter what's going on Sunday night. It doesn't matter if I travel on Tuesday. It doesn't matter what's going on Wednesday. Like, that's the fucking standard. So my feelings, listen to me, my feelings have nothing to do with it. Whether I want to go to the gym, whether I feel like going to the gym, whether I had something going on, whether I was up too late, like, it doesn't fucking matter. And that's a difference between a standard and being serious and kind of wanting it. Do you understand what I'm saying? The other standard is that I don't drink alcohol during the week. Listen, I am a part degenerate just like everyone else. I enjoy drinks. I enjoy having a good time. I enjoy smoking cigars. Like I enjoy some dysfunction for sure. But the discipline is what has given me all of these amazing opportunities in life. So once again, why would I not drive more discipline in my life if I want more opportunities? They're very, they're literally correlated together. If you are not finding the opportunities you want in your life, drive more discipline in it and see if you get there. See if they start to become more real. So once again, no drinking during the week. Why do I not drink during the week? Because as soon as you start drinking during the week, your motivation ticks down a little bit. When your motivation ticks down a little bit, then it starts to get into your feelings. You start to say things like this. Well, I tried really hard this week so I can take today off. Or, you know what? I deserve a day off. But do you really deserve a fucking day off? No, you didn't have a standard. Then on top of that, it creeped in because you were a little bit weaker and then you gave in, which means I beat you today because you stayed in bed and I didn't. Do you see what I'm saying? And then your competition is looking at you the same way. That's how I think about it. Whether that's true or false or whatever, that's the narrative. That's the standard. And so whether your standard is 3 a.m., 4 a.m., it doesn't matter. It's all relative, right? So the other standard is and it has been now for a really long time, after I lift weights, there's some type of conditioning. Right now, I've been walking on the treadmill on the incline. It used to be 800 meters of lunges for the last decade. Either way, there's a standard of 20 to 60 minutes at this point, and I'm going to come back to this, of conditioning that I'm doing. The reason why I'm doing 45 to 60, walking on the incline, very old school bodybuilding right now, and like I said, what used to be at the track doing lunges is because I'm addicted to the personal development. So there's a standard for me that not only every day am I working on my body, I'm also working on my mind. Now, I have the Monday show. I have these daily fires. I have to bring you some type of information that has value that I believe I have extracted from either someone else or my own fucking self to you on this day. And so now it's like there's 329 daily fires. Those are all representative of me having a standard of personal development every day. So keep in mind, I told you four really key items. Number one, I have to fucking train at a certain time, Monday through Friday. That's just a non-negotiable. Number two, there's no drinking during the week, which then does not take down my motivation so I can make sure I make that call time for that training. Number three, there's conditioning that happens every day. And that could be, you could lift weights for 10 minutes and walk for 20 minutes and that could be your thing, right? Mine is way more advanced and a little bit more extreme, but it's all relative. Number four, personal development has to happen every day. So if I then have a discipline to be someplace, that's my practice time. I have a discipline to make sure that I have to show up and it's going to physically I'm physically lifting weights. It's going to make me feel better, right? That's like one of the best antidepressants on the planet. On top of that, I have a conditioning component that's feeding my mind at the same time. So you wrap that around with no drinking during the week. And on top of that, you start to think, if I can continue being consistent on this standard, what is possible? 
what is possible. That's what you have to think. If I can be consistent with standards like this, now they could be less extreme than the standards I just laid out. That's the ones that work for me. And at the end of the day, if they keep fucking working, why would I change them? I just want to improve upon them. I just maybe add a little bit of time, take a little time away, whatever that is. I'm always adding and subtracting to the process. But the reality is I keep getting a certain result, whether it's my body, whether it's my mind, whether it's my business, whether it's my lifestyle. And so I keep driving it home. So please look at what are your fucking standards and do you keep to them? And is it important to you? And they need to be important to you. And on top of that, try one, see what the result is and then go from there. But please have some fucking standards that you adhere to in your life. It'll make a lot of your dreams have more possibilities to come true. Daily Fire episode 329.